and today I'll be showing you a possible workaround for the Anaconda 3 installation bug. So first you need to download the 64-bit or the 32-bit variant depending on your computer which you can check it right here. This PC properties and then the system type minus 64-bit one that's why I've downloaded the 64-bit version. So yeah before installing there's one important thing which you need to do that is go to advanced system settings then environment variables and then you need to change this path variable a little, a little bit so this problem arises because there's some other software conflicting with the VS code uh, variable and the VS code is the anaconda variable so first what you need to do is just back these up in a notepad or whatever text editor you use and uh, delete them later so back these up and then yeah, delete both of them, the user profile and the CPHP. And this won't be there for you guys. It's there for me because I've installed it already. So this should be clean totally. And after that, just press OK. Press OK here too and then close it off. And continue with your installation. So in the installation, when it asks you for uh, just me or all users, if you are the admin, just install it for all users. Else, just do it for yourself. And then install it and see for you know like it's better that way and it'll show an error for me or oh, okay, it's not showing cool yeah so advanced option you check both of them i don't really know what this does but then it just works like this so just check it and install i'm not going to install it again because i've already done it and then cancel it i mean i'll cancel it but you guys don't yeah so after this go back to environment variables after the installation is done I mean and then I uh, edit the path variable again this time you'll see this VS code thingy after that just add back all the uh, variables however they were like in the same order for me user profile was before so I put it above VS code and which and I think the VS code should be above other software so like this was the other software I put VS code above it that's all that's how you need to do it and that's it I'll fix the error there won't be any problems with your menu or anything so that's it for today thank you for watching the video please like comment and subscribe goodbye